All right, what do you want to talk to me about? You'll have to get busy with the shadow with the snag machine. I've asked Dayton, of course, to analyze the contents of the data ROM. Michael! Bye, Jovi. Seeing Jovi and her boundless energy makes me realize I'm back home. Anyway, I wonder what's on that data ROM. <laughs> Michael, was it clear yet? Go see Dayton, Michael. So here's the director's office. And here's Dayton. Hi, Jovi. Wait. Jovi, where's Dayton? Did you kill him? Jovi wonders where he went. Anyone seen Dayton? <gasps> My boy! Kick, kick. Dayton, let me think. Oh, he went downstairs earlier. He had this look of conster consternation. He had this look of consternation on his face. Adon, I don't think that's a word. Hey, anyone seen Dayton? I saw Dayton trudging outside the lab with a forlorn expression on his face. Is there something the matter? Dayton! Hey! Uh, I couldn't decipher it! Oh, it's you, Michael. You scared me half to death. The data ROM is heavily protected like a bank vault. It would take a seriously talented guy to break through and get out at the contents. A seriously talented guy, you say? Are you saying you're not seriously talented, Dayton? You're fired. I'm terribly sorry. It can't be helped. And if it's a seriously talented guy we need, well, I think I may have a solution. Who would that person be? Michael, I'm sorry to spring this on you, but can you deliver the data ROM to ONBS in Pyrite Town? Dayton, please hand the data ROM to Michael, please. Oh, right away. ONBS is known as a TV network, but they're much more than that. The people that later founded ONBS were actually instrumental in breaking Cypher's conspiracy five years ago. Please deliver that data ROM to Net at ONBS. He's the right hand man to SEC, ONBS's leader. I'm confident that he'll be able to get the contents of the data ROM. We'd love to see the kids' grid actually uh, in a high paying job since uh, the first game. I mean, we get to hear the cool snaps of Pyrite Town. That's what I'm excited for. And the baseline. Hell yeah. There goes Marcia, tearing off like a tornado as usual. There goes one busy girl. Huh? What's up with you, kid? Why are you giving me the eye like that? Do you know who I am? I'm Kale. They call me the gatekeeper of Pyrite. Yeah. <laughs> the smoldering look says you're raring to challenge me. If it's a battle you want, I'm here. Alright then. I'll show you what being Kale, the gatekeeper of Pyrite, is all about. Unfortunately, we don't have a shadow Pokemon to steal from him this time. But fortunately... He's less of a threat than before. Alright, let's finish this up right quick. Shabam! A C dot. I'm in trouble. Well, because I'm in trouble, I think I should switch out rain and bring in Squirtle.
Get him, Scuttle. I believe in you. Doodle ding. <gasps> A hound hour. Well, I was gonna keep Scuttle in because he's good against C dot, but now I'm not so sure. Actually, instead of. Well, hmm. Wait a minute. No, he's too slow. Hound Hour would outspeed him. Let's send in somebody. How close is everybody? Yeah, it doesn't really matter. Let's send in Sveal. And then we will embitter. We will embarrass. Uh, anyway. Burn Descenders. Whoa, there he goes. Spinning up a storm. Mud Slap. Let's do it. Uh. <laughs> I should actually do something stronger than Mud Slap. Damn, Kale, get good. You fool. I have thick fat. A sad awoo. And his back is broken. Hey kid, I have to hand it to you. You have to be good to be Kale, Pirate's Gatekeeper. Hey, do you think you're walking away from Kale, Pirate's Gatekeeper? They call me the Pirate's Gatekeeper, did you know? Where are you going? We're not done yet. I do want to switch in Scoodle before I forget. Hello. Seen any crimes? Town has become peaceful, but there's still plenty of roughnecks around. They know how to keep us busy while with their brawling and so on. Lots of them will go out of their way to pick a fight with you. Be careful when you're out in the streets. Any familiar faces in here? Got lumps in my head from some shiny-headed guy thumping me. Den I don't deny I lipped him off at first. Lift off, lipped off at him first. But he took a swing at me first. You gotta let me out of here. Now, if only I had a key. I'm also robbing the police. As you do. And he has nothing more to say to us. Whatever, guy. Hmm, those guys look familiar. Alright then, what have we here? We'll visit Trudely and Folly. What do you think you're up to? What are we up to? You got it all wrong. We're just here to do some shopping, that's all. No, don't you lie to me. I know about the likes of you. You're up to no good, aren't you? Cut us some slack, Officer Johnson, sir. We had a change of heart. We've sworn off our criminal ways. Yes, sir. No, no, no. That doesn't wash with me. No, sir, it doesn't. I won't have you lot walking around the streets as if you own the place. <laughs> Pompous oaf. Folly, the man won't listen to reason. Let's get out of here. Later! Boy, you got, you got schooled, huh? They wreaked havoc as if they owned the place, but I caught up with them and put them straight. I cut quite the dashing figure, don't I? It's my job to uphold the peace of Pyrite. Pow! I'm a superhero! Sure enough, Officer Johnson, that's what you is. Looks like there aren't any pocket balls in this location. Still grab some revives. He's duking around. Hi, Silva. I'm the operating manager of Pyrite Coliseum. Well, I'm manager in title only. I'm just filling in. Duking, the town's leader, discovered a place where wild Pokemon gather. Ever since then, he's been engrossed in searching for wild Pokemon. 
In the meantime, he's left me in charge of the Coliseum. If you're going to battle, you should go straight to the Coliseum reg registration desk and apply. I wonder if we're even capable of handling it right now. I make pokey snacks. Right, you. I don't know why they locked me up in this dank cave. I don't think the hotel has anything for us, but we can check. Paralyze heal. I guess that's kind of useful. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to barge in. Oh, hey, another thing. Focus band. Ooh. That is going to be situationally useful, but it could come in use. Let's, uh, let's give that to Scuttle, because we have nothing better for it. Man, I was very wrong about there being nothing here. I was at the Coliseum where I managed to beat my first three opponents, but I couldn't pull off the last win. You don't win the prize if you can't put together a four-win streak. I'm gonna get some harder to rest and make another challenge. Well, the dual square is still here. They don't have shadow Pokemon, but it could make for some good training. This is a dual square where the weak fail and the strong prevail. Don't be rattled if someone suddenly challenges you to a battle. I didn't challenge you, but we're battling anyway. A ghost. And a bug. Ladybug. Well, I've got the nighttime uh, counterpart to the daytime ladybug over there. Let's... Oh, right, I don't have Blitz anymore. Uh... I don't know, Signal Beam? <laughs> now that's something I can handle. Hup, hup, hup! Blah-blah! The bugs are duking it out. That's did did still did half its health. And it confused it. Don't you go messing with Scuttle. He's gonna kick your butt. Beep beep. <gasps> Egg! Kill the egg! Targeting system activated. Ready to kill. <laughs> Remoraid loaded. Quick, kill the gun! I can't believe we shot the gun with a gun of water. Pew. Speed. Oh no, he got the flight move. Okay, good. He's an idiot. Or she. It's an idiot. Pew. Run away and trip over before you get sent back to your Pokeball. That's like one experience away, by the way. I feel like crying. And here I feel like dancing. Dancing. Dance the night away. Um, I want to switch the position of moves of Spinarak. Let's do Signal Beam up top. Yellow. Doesn't matter to me who my opponents are, even little kids. I battle with all my might. Right or dirt? Dirt in Pyrite Town? Perish the thought. Okay, this is very unfavorable for my little bug guy. So, what I'm gonna do is not keep the bug guy in. Rain, you can water gun the slugma. And reap. You come back in here. Uh, uh! 
Oh, okay. Level up. Look at Natu. A dish? A dish? Curse you, Natu. Now it's gonna take me longer to kill you. Shabam! Yep. Remember when I said that it would take me longer to kill you? I lied. Something smells nice. That makes me move slower. Therefore, it makes me easier to hit. Spadoom. Looking forward to when we fight Gloom and seeing it freak out every time it gets a hit. Or gets hit, rather. A heart attack. <clears throat> I can't believe he's dead. Ah, he's alright. He got better. Bonjour! Did you know? My Pokemon and I match très bien. I don't think I can ever lose now. I'll show you my aggressive style. And I will now henceforth be dropping the French accent because I cannot keep it up for very long. Which is also a statement I shouldn't really say out loud to a public audience. Anyway, uh, how about water gun and we'll dig tentacle. We can dig it, sucker. <laughs> All right, that's enough of that. Here we go. There he goes. She goes. I'm gonna be misgendering my Pokemon. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Here I go. Hadja. <laughs> Chin lands barely off screen. Darn it all. Look at him. I was seized by the urge. Don't... Don't talk to me. With lines like that, no thank you. Did anyone see any truffles around here? Oh man, that's what I should name a, uh, a pile of swine or something if I'm doing uh, Monster Hunter themed names in the future. Is moss swine. Don't need to go for the, the Gamoth route, that's also pretty easy to do. Because mammoth swine is literally just a mammoth. But moss swine works. There's similarities. Alright, so you may think I'm crazy, but all I want is you. You may think that I can just stick in and everything will be fine, but I'm not going to take that risk. So what I'm going to do is switch out to Meep. Get that shadow gauge down, and also protect against potential flying attacks. Eh. Ah. 
Okay, so I was right to worry about flying attacks. He was wrong to target me with that specifically. So good job on that. Look out, it's a crow. And we're good. Boink, boink. Oh no, not reverse mode. Ah, we're fine. Meep! Don't hurt yourself! Don't think too hard about it. We could have finished it there, but we also finished the heart gauge by doing this, so... Win-win. Yeah! Level 19. Proud of him. Her. Proud of Sp Scuttle. Oh dear. That did a lot of damage. Get up. Fight back. Fight the power. Oh, Mega Zoom in. Doosh. At least he didn't have a heart attack like that one rider did. Guys, Mareep can be purified. Aren't you happy? We live by tradition here. Remember, take off your shoes before entering a building. That's pronounced Rawling or Railing? Because if it's Hunter Railing, then what is the Hunter... Anyway. Neither of these boys seem particularly dangerous, so I guess I'll just dig. Marp! I think Wismer should have an ability that uh, lessens the damage of uh, sound moves, and then once it evolves, it gains an ability that increases the damage of sound-based moves. Not necessarily Loudred. Uh, maybe Loudred could have a, a throwaway ability so that its sound moves are at default volume. But Wismer would be quieter, and Xplod would be louder. You know what I mean? Loudred is just the uh, the standard decibel level. Oh no, is a snake. The Tsuchinoko. Well, seeing as uproar isn't really doing much. And we're back. Oh no, Thigh F. Don't take my item! Okay, good. It didn't take my item. <laughs> Meanwhile, Wismer. Finish that up, and we'll dig. Because we know we're faster than Wismer. Despite being a Spinarak that is brave nature. We're still somehow faster than Wismer. Nice try, fool.
What a surprise. Yep. Sure thing. Sure enough. That is true. Valid. If anyone demands a battle in Dual Square. Yeah, about that. No one's gonna spot me in Dual Square and be like, hey, fight me. It's always gonna be me walking up to the and being like, hey, fight me. Do, 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 do. Man, that guy is running. I guess he's sprinting one way. The name's Rocket! There once was a town ruled by Cypher beneath the cliff here. The town was just called the Under. When Cypher's hold over the town was broken, the Under citizens moved out into the sunlight. I'm one of them. ONBS's Ned is another former resident of the Under. They went and buried the Under to prevent people from getting to the abandoned town site. It's sad to see my hometown go like that. I actually forget if you're able to access the under in this game. Sveal can now be purified too. Neat. And we're right next to a PC, so how about we hold a couple of ceremonies? Ceremonies. Let's go with that. Uh, can I do it from here? Oh, hang on. Yeah, we do need a regular old Pokemon. go. Uh, let's grab something. Nope. Actually, wrong one. There we go. Right. I can't perform a purification ceremony until I'm back at uh, the the lab. The high quality lab. So, I guess I'll go do that. It's also faster to do it this way than, uh, than go to Agate Village every time. Fewer cutscenes, you can do multiples at once. It's just convenient. Now, if only you could do it from the PC. Purify me. Fractal code digitize. And we get Aurora Beam. And we get Refresh, Charm. It's one of three moves Charm, Heal Bell, or Refresh, I swear. It automatically switches to the right set, and we're golden. Boom. Boop, boop, boop. Good job, Meep. Body slam. Not that it's good for it. Doesn't have great physical attack. And it dinged once, probably. Yep, just the once. What? Mareep is evolving. And now he sit down. Mareep evolved into Fluffy. And we got a ribbon. Let me in. Let me in! Let's edit some sets. Uh, no. Actually, Teddy Ursa, you can stay in there. Because if you have a set full of normal types, you actually have a, uh, a good tempo going. Because normal's not super effective against anything. It's just good against itself in this particular context. All right, uh, let's do this, and let's also put Fluffy in right here. 
So we have a really good tempo. If only this was something that'd be good against uh, electric and uh, weak against bug flying. But uh, this is fine as is. And uh, Numbul should be purified really fast. Uh, do I want to... Yeah, let's bring him in. Let's bring him in. And we're good. We'll just leave them to their own devices, and eventually we'll come back to purify them. I wonder what he's playing. Or working very hard on. Looks like something you see at an arcade or something. An 80s or 90s arcade, even. Back to jam and music. And I think before we go pay a visit to Net, I want to go and uh, do attempt a Coliseum challenge. But I also want to check between episodes uh, if it's even doable at my current level. I think it is. But that'll be for next time. Yep, looks good to me. Alright, that'll be for next time then. See ya!